three reasons you need a cooking iron. This right here is the trusty cooking iron, and I think it is one of the most underrated pieces of camp cooking gear out there. So in this video, we're gonna chat why you might wanna get one of these, and we're also gonna do some cooking. <laughs> Reason number one that I love these cooking irons is they are so easy to use. So I will link to these below. These are by the brand Camp Chef, and these are my favorite ones. One of the reasons is they come pre-seasoned. So this is cast iron. It needs to be seasoned before you can use it and so these are pretty much ready to go right out of the box and then they have a little latch here and it opens up and you can put your food in here close it and then you cook it over the fire here I got my fire going we're gonna do breakfast first I made sure I was really hungry for this video it's <laughs> gonna do some omelets and some hash browns and then move on to some pizza pockets for dinner and then end things off with dessert now one thing to kind of note is if you do have a bigger group of campers you are gonna probably want more than one of these because this is an individual serving this one is a double cooking iron which is great you can do two at once so just kind of think about that depending on your group size you might need more than one let's get these omelets going i am hungry so within seconds we got the hash browns ready to go on to the fire and then i'm going to do the omelet just got some scrambled eggs I have some cooked chopped bacon, some onions, some shredded cheddar cheese. I did all this prep at home, so it's just so simple. The thing with the cooking iron though is be prepared to use a lot of butter. <laughs> Time for the omelet. Let's take a look. Woo! Yes. The flies have found us. But here's breakfast. I mean, this looks so incredible and it tastes, it's so good. Cash browns were really made for the cooking iron. As you can see with something like this, I mean, the possibilities are endless for combinations with the egg and it's just so easy and so delicious. So I'm gonna dive into this and then next, we're gonna do some dinner. <laughs> Reason number two that cooking irons are so awesome is you can make a variety of things with them. So no one wants a piece of camping gear that just sits in the garage collecting dust, right? And I think when a lot of people think of cooking irons, they think of like maybe a dessert, like a pie or something, and maybe you have one and you just never use it. I'm here to tell you that there is a lot of stuff that you can make with the cooking iron from today. We're going from breakfast all the way up to dessert. The dinner that I want to show you today is pizza pocket. You may have seen me make these a few times throughout the years in my videos. I just love them. They're so delicious. I mean, who doesn't love pizza? <laughs> and they're really easy and fun to make with the cooking iron. So I have some pizza cheese here. I'm gonna do pepperoni. I have basil. I have some chopped peppers and onions and all that kind of stuff. So you can customize this so many different ways. So let's get started. Pizza boy. Got some pizzas. I did a veggie one and then a pepperoni one. Another reason to love the cooking iron is it's a great way to get everyone involved in the cooking process, especially with something like these pizza pockets. Everyone can make their own and kind of have fun coming up with their own combinations and sitting around the campfire and feeling that satisfaction and fun of cooking and making their own meal. So it's instead of having like one person cooking, which I love to cook, so I definitely don't mind doing that. But this is kind of not only food, but it's also an activity in itself. And it's just a great way to spend quality time with your friends and family around the campfire when you don't have service and you're not distracted by all of the modern day like tech and social media and to-do lists and all those things like really just enjoy that time around the campfire cooking and eating a delicious meal so it's just one of the the core reasons that i love camping and especially camp cooking and the cooking iron fits right into that these smell so good look at that yes 
I mean, ooh, that's hot. <laughs> How awesome does that look? Oh my gosh, do you see this? Hot. But wait, there's more. <laughs> Not only have we made pizza pockets and omelets, we're also gonna make some brownies next. So stay tuned. Brownie time. Got my brownie batter here. Yeah. And I'm just gonna put this into my cooking iron. Have a little butter in there. <laughs> more butter. Just a tad more. Gotta cover up my batter because the flies are coming for me. All right, let's get that going. Brownie is done. Let's open this up. Let this baby cool for a little bit. Oh my gosh, I love brownies. While this is cooling, let's talk about the third reason to get a cooking iron. And it is, they are incredibly easy to clean and take care of. So as you saw, we cooked omelets, hash browns, uh, pizza pockets, and now brownies. And I haven't cleaned the cooking iron at all in between any of that. So this is right after the pizza pockets. And in general, what I will do for cleaning is I will just take a paper towel or I have a bunch of these little kitchen towels that I bring camping and I'll just wipe it out. There are some things that you can make that are a little bit stickier. And in those cases, yes, I do have to get in here and clean it a little bit more, but for the most part, they're just so easy to take care of. And when you're out camping, you wanna have nice, easy, delicious meals and not have a ton of cleanup. So I think the cooking iron really fits that bill. If I have piqued your curiosity in this video, I do have a cooking iron ebook that has tons of meal ideas and recipes all with the cooking iron from breakfast, there's lunch, there's snacks, sides, dinner, and dessert. So I will link to that in the description below if you wanna just dive into the wonderful world of the cooking iron. <laughs> so let's get into this brownie before the flies get it because they are out. I don't have a plate though. Stay tuned, hold on, get a plate. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Ideally, I would probably let this cool a little bit more before I dive into it, but let's, let's give it a try. Oh, actually it's too hot. I'll break off an edge so you can see. Oh, yes, gooey, fudgy. Oh my gosh. Mmm. I love a good fudgy brownie. Who's with me? I know people are like either cake like brownies or fudgy brownies, but in my mind, I'm like, if you want a cake like brownie, just eat a chocolate cake. Brownie should be dense and gooey and mm, so good. With that, I am full. <laughs> I am happy to be outside cooking. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I put all the links in the description below the video for these cooking irons, for my ebook. And if you like this, watch this video next. Got some more camp cooking for you over here. And I will see you in that one.